right now, airlines are testing sort of the biggest blooming network in the world, and that's social networks, including Facebook with almost 500 million users, Twitter with a couple hundred million. They're testing new marketing strategies, and it's a real-time nature that we've never seen before in the industry where they're actually putting out deals only for a short window of time, only in that channel. Typically, these deals they're putting out there only for a couple hours. So if you, you know, for example, wanted to go to Anchorage, Alaska uh, yesterday and you were online, you could see it within a two-hour window. You could have got half price off to Anchorage, which is typically a six to $700 ticket for three, $400 sometimes. Great deals. Hawaii, they throw out there sometimes. It's not like they're going to send you an email later after the fact or you're going to get an alert through a text message on Twitter and Facebook only. The first thing to do is to look at all the airline sites. The airlines all have special accounts. You have JetBlue Cheaps, Southwest Airlines has a really popular account. In general, it's the low-cost airlines that have embraced it and have literally hundreds and hundreds of thousands of followers. Um, and the, the legacy airlines are playing catch-up right now. If you go, for instance, on my account, which is at Rick Cini on Twitter, I actually have lists of these and you can one click follow all the airlines in one click. Make sure you can have Facebook and Twitter on your phone because a lot of things that you'll want are in real time and you might not be glued to your computer and want that stuff. If you have an issue with an airline at an airport, you get stuck, you're delayed, you're, have, you're, you're behind 100 people at the counter, take your phone out, tweet something onto Twitter or put something on Facebook account and you're likely to get a response almost immediately during the week when those PR people are there. At faircompare.com, we launched 170 city-based Twitter accounts where they're all called Fly From and the three-letter city code. All day long, from our real-time feeds, we tweet out deals that are occurring from the airlines for over 500 airlines worldwide. So it's a great way to get me out of town for the weekend or to check out trips or see when prices drop. I know a lot of people get email alerts. They get emails from the airlines. Twitter is a great place to learn that through those kind of feeds.